Hello viewers, in today's session we are going to discuss one important property of a Dirac delta function involving the derivative of delta function. Right. So in this session we are going to uh, prove this result or this property in which the derivative of delta function is involved. So we have to prove that the integral that is minus infinity to infinity fx uh, delta prime of x dx is equal to negative of f prime of 0. Right. So let us start. So now let us quickly see the definition of a delta function. The delta function is defined as delta of x is equal to uh, 0 uh, whenever uh, x is not equal to 0 and delta of x is infinity uh, when x is equal to 0. Right? And we can extend this uh, definition uh, to this one that is the delta of x minus a is 0 whenever x is not equal to a and delta of x minus a is infinity uh, whenever x is equal to a right so here uh, let us uh, assume that the derivative of delta function it exists and let us call this integral as i we have minus infinity to infinity f of x and delta prime of x dx. So here I uh, will make use of uh, the method of integration by parts. So now the formula for integration by parts is given by uh, u dv that is integral u dv is equal to uv minus integral uh, v du where u and uh, v are both uh, suppose uh, the functions of x. Right. Okay. So here uh, this integral can be written as minus infinity to infinity. Here this function f of x is associated with the delta function. So we'll keep it as such. Now delta prime of x can be uh, written as uh, d by dx of delta x. Right. So now uh, d of delta x that is uh, the derivative of delta x can be written as the delta prime of x and dx. So now uh, delta prime dx can be replaced by uh, d of delta x that is derivative of delta x. Right Now uh, this function may be taken as u and this function may be taken as v. Right. So let us take f of x is equal to u and uh, delta of x is equal to v so that uh, we have uh, now uh, this form that is uh, minus infinity to infinity uh, for fx we have u and for delta x we have v so this is uh, dv. So now applying uh, this rule that is integration by parts we can now write uh, here uh, uv that is the product of u and v. So u is f of x and v is delta of x then we have integral and the limits are from minus infinity to infinity and v is uh, given by uh, delta x and uh, du is given by uh, d of uh, f of x right and here uh, note that uh, here we have to uh, take the limits that is minus infinity to infinity so now uh, let us uh, first consider uh, this term so here uh, we have the product of f of x and uh, delta x and delta x tends to uh, 0 when x tends to infinity or x tends to uh, minus infinity right see because uh, the delta function uh, is 0 for all x not equal to 0 and delta x takes the value uh, infinity uh, when x is equal to uh, 0 right so this term uh, reduces to 0 because delta x tends to 0 when x tends to infinity or x tends to minus infinity 
so now uh, we are left with the zero minus and here we have minus infinity to infinity and delta x and uh, the derivative that is d of f of x so d of f of x is equal to f prime of x uh, dx right so here we can now write f prime of x and dx so this is now equal to negative of the integral minus infinity to infinity f prime of x and here we have delta x and dx so now the value of this integral i is equal to negative of uh, the integral minus infinity to infinity f prime of x and delta x dx right so now to move further here I uh, will make use of another important uh, property of Dirac delta function and the property says that the integral minus infinity to infinity and if we have a function say g of x and here we have delta of x dx then the value of this integral is given by the value of this function at uh, x is equal to 0 so here we have g of uh, 0 so now if we compare uh, this integral uh, with this one then uh, the function uh, g of x may be taken as f prime of x right so the value of uh, this integral this integral is given by uh, minus and here uh, we can write uh, f prime of 0 because uh, uh, we are writing g of x is equal to f prime of x. So now the value of this integral uh, minus infinity to infinity f of x delta prime of x dx is equal to a negative of f prime of 0. Right? So here's, this is how uh, we can uh, prove uh, this property of Dirac delta function in which the derivative of uh, delta function is involved.